You guys ever see those videos of the people that explore caves and they go through like super tight spaces? Like I'm talking super narrow spaces that human beings should not be going through. Every time I see one of those videos, I almost puke. I get so uncomfortable. I get so claustrophobic. I've heard stories of people getting stuck like that and they can't do anything so their skeletons are still there years later. People are crazy, man. It's like the people that do parkour on top of skyscrapers. I get a hobby, but like when the hobby is literally risking your life, hey, I'm gonna leave it to you, I don't understand it, but those people are a different breed. Anyway, what is going on guys? Welcome back to another video, happy Tuesday. So for today's video, I actually have something pretty fun planned out, at least I think it'll be fun. We're gonna hop in the time machine and travel back to what I consider the last, you know, good Madden. That is Madden 20. Back then, I actually played it on Xbox over PlayStation, so I had the game installed, meaning I didn't have to buy it again, so there's no issue in me re-downloading it for a game on YouTube. So, I hope you guys are excited for that. One quick thing before we head into it, hop over to gfuel.com, use code Wyatt's World, save yourself a discount on any G Fuel products. Let's go back and play some Madden 20. <laughs> I actually want my headphones on so I can hear what the songs were. I remember them being bangers. Big numbers. How was this game three years ago already, man? Wow, that just kicked me back. Okay, so why don't we have a look at the menu? So we've got the BLM message still up. I believe this was right around the George Floyd incident. We'll just not talk about that tragedy. We're here for happy times. But we got Exhibition, Franchise, KO, QB1 Face of the Franchise, and Ultimate Team. So basically, it's the same, except I do think it looks more creative. No lagginess in the menu either. Everything just moves fluently. Dude, I swear the Madden 22 menu lags like every time time I'm just trying to do this. Go peek at the rosters, eh? Whew. Okay, not as bad as Madden 19, but the ratings are <laughs> Lorenzo Alexander. The ratings are still a little bit fucked, if you ask me. Josh is still a 77. Ridiculous. Von Miller was a 96 only in this game. Fucking Cardinals were bad too, holy shit. So of course, Mahomes was a 99. Tyreek was a 96. Travis Kelsey was a 96. Zeke was still a 93. What was Dak? 81, Jesus. <laughs> <laughs> the Dolphins. <laughs> Akeem to leave, man. Eagles are elite still. Julio was a 97. I love to see it, man. Kittle was a 97. Sherman was a 94. Emmanuel Sanders was an 89. Young ass Fred Warner. Love it. I think his jersey should be here today, by the way, that I ordered. Yikes. Where's Daniel Jones? 70. Fournette was an 83? Holy shit. Darius Slay was still a lion at an 87. Kenny was an 86. Aaron Rodgers was an 89? What fucking stats did he throw up the year before? Jesus, was that his injury year? I don't understand. Christian McCaffrey and Keekly were both 99s, huh? Earl Thomas, 93. Lamar was already a 92. Michael Pierce at 91. Jesus, the Ravens are elite. Michael Thomas was a 99. I'm pissed. Damn, the Texans would be pretty good. Let's look at the Vikings quick. Oh shit, they're good. Griffin was still an 89. Eric Kendricks an 89. Daniel Hunter's young as fuck, dude. This is sick. Okay, so now that we got to take a peek at the roster and everything, we're gonna actually go play some online, but it's gonna be KO, because this was the game that KO was introduced in, it was the game that KO was elite in, it was so good. Yeah, look dude, it had fucking Snoop Dogg in it and shit. Like, they actually cared. Yeah, we got Dot City, The Magician, Snappers, Record Breakers, Backyard Heroes, Florida Keys, Fundamentals, Shutdown. Wait till you see the people that they give us, though. All right, so round one's a little bit of a dud here. All right, we'll take MT since he's, like, the best receiver in the game, and I don't want to pick Breeze as my quarterback. There's some really fun quarterbacks in here. Randall Cunningham is in here. All right, we got another dud here. Melvin Gordon, Mike Evans, Delvin Cook, or Mahomes. We'll do Melvin Gordon. If I don't get anybody cool, we might reshuffle. There, Marvin Harrison, like that. Now I'm happy, let's roll. Brett Favre is in this game, Peyton's in this game, CJ2K is in this game, Chad Johnson, Randy Moss, Terrell Owens, Palomalu, Ray Lewis, Ed Reed, Erlacher, I'm pretty sure. I mean, it is juiced. There, he's got someone. Is that Patrick Willis? Look how much better the game looked. It just looks better. The pictures are better, for God's sake. Beautiful start. That happens every time we play KO. I swear to God, the first round is a bye. Oh, nice. I'm the one that lagged out, apparently. Let's try it again. Boom, Brian Erlacher right away. Oh, a gold star Mahomes! Let's go! There we go. This guy's got Ed Reed, someone from Migos, and DeAndre Hopkins. Good God. Also, KO had levels in this. It was awesome! DJ Khaled, get off my screen. I think this Mahomes can actually run, too. 
Yeah, he can. Look how goddamn fast he is. Jesus. No, 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 no. Bro, I had such a good team. Not gonna lie, again, the running feels way more precise in this than the new gen. Oh, there we go. We got Jim Brown or Mahomes. I'll take Jim Brown. He's impossible to tackle, and I really want Randall Cunningham. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh, John Elway, though? I mean, he's a legend quarterback. Let's take him. Probably, honestly, would have rather had the legend Mahomes, though, again. CJ, 2K, Vic, Marvin Harrison, Donald. I'm fucked. This guy's a level 39 player, too. Holy shit, he hasn't stopped. No, 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 no. I really wish the playbook would go back to what it is right here. It was faster to everything. Honestly, I, I feel like this game runs smoother. I'm sure you guys can tell, too. The movement is just crazy. What you gonna do? What you gonna do? He's gonna hit CJ2K. Oh, I was there! So basically, this does feel a lot like when I went back to Madden 19, except the juke stick isn't on the run stick. Come on, bitch. Come on, bitch. Oh! Oh, that's mine, that's mine, that's mine! What are you doing?! That's mine, that's mine! Akeem Tlaib, the menace to society! Alright, let's play some good offense now. Let's pass the ball a little bit. We got Big John Elway. Precision pass. Greg Olson, still in his prime. Bingo! We need somebody here, we need somebody. Greg Olson! No! Come on! Can't be playing stupid. Also, if you didn't notice, Tug of War has five plays instead of three. You got speed, I got power, bitch. Oh! Ow! Oh! Ow! Oh! I don't like this. Oh yeah, also, I don't know if it does this on the new game or not, but the end zones get smaller. Why did they ever take this out? Calling audible is a little bit different too. I can't really depict what it is, but it's not the same buttons that it is on the like, current. No, that's bad. I mean, Jesus. Screw Michael Vick, man. All right, we'll go play just an exhibition game so I can at least score a touchdown before we call it a day. All right, I'll be the Bills and we'll play against uh, the Jets. Why not? Actually, I want to be the Ravens, dude. They're elite. So we're actually just going to do a Super Sim 2 to only play offense. I don't need to play defense against the bot Jets. Really, all I want to do is just run circles around them with Lamar and then maybe throw a bomb or two. Oh, God. Willie Sneed? I forgot about him, dude. Did he even play last year? I want to say he went to the Raiders. He's literally Vic! He's literally Vic! Part of the movement is like there's no weight delay and that's kind of unrealistic. I understand it now. Like in real life, if you're gonna be juking, you're gonna have a little bit of a delay on your movements because your weight is shifting from one side of your body to another. This game, there's no delay. You can just zigzag or do whatever you want. Feels better, but I am starting to understand why they took it out. Oh! <laughs> Hollywood! He's elite! Marky Mark? I just threw a pick against the bot. I'm so stunned right now. Look at this shit. It's effortless for 10 yards every time. He doesn't fumble or nothing. Just run out literally every time with Lamar. I don't know how people ever lost online with him. This is cheese. Oh, the Jets scored? That's humorous. Come on, Willie! Ah! Steamboat Willie! He's elite! Imagine, 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 there's no way, there's no way, oh my god, the bot is horrid. How far can we take it back? How far can we actually take this shit back? Jamal's coming at me, I gotta go. No, oh, no, 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 no. Oh, this is ridiculous. Go, Lamar, go, Lamar, go. I gotta work my way around him again. Leg it out, leg it out. Leg it out! Leg it out! Go, go, go! This is ridiculous! Lamar is elite! <laughs> Alright guys, and that is gonna be all for today's video. I hope you guys like the time travel back to Madden 20. I had a blast. Maybe we'll come back and play KO again. I gotta practice though because I need to be a little bit better at this. It is a lot different. I don't want to use that as an excuse. But if it needs to be, then I'm a bitch. Anyway, if you guys like this video, show support in any way you can. You know what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna hop off and get this shit edited so you can watch it on time. Have a fantastic rest of your week, guys. As always, I'll see you the next time I upload.